Hey guys, Jake Red here. It's a quick video just showing you guys the diamond locations. Um, the diamonds I have now are from the two on the top of the big tree, and then the house on the left when you come out. There's also a diamond in the back house. Uh, so that'll give you four if you can get all of them. So then there's also four diamonds, five diamonds on the surface down here in the caves. So I get them first usually, because I want to get the other pick as well. Because, um, I find I go through a pick before I'm done. So I'm at six. Just as just, just a three. I didn't get all four of them. Seven. Eight. Alright, so these are the ones that are on the surface. So from there, you want to just kind of look for this thing here. And then just dig in and dig down till you're right here. Get one more. And there you go. So that's nine. There's another one in here somewhere, but I can't remember where it is, so I'm not going to show you guys that one for now, but you can dig around in there and check if you want. Uh, so then you just go right across from where you dug, out, dug in, and go down, see, look, just right across, and then you get another one. So from right here, you dig up here in like a staircase kind of way. Oh, there's a bit of lag going on, it's going to wait here for a second, here we go. Just dig in a staircase kind of way. Right up to the back. There you go. So I'm at 11. You come to the edge here. You look up. Mm, nope. This right here. You come up. And you dig. There you go. So at 12. Come here. Dig down here. Now different people have different ways of getting to this. This is just how I get to this one. 13. Come in here. Like, think about right in the middle of the square and just dig a little doorway. There's one here. That's 14, so just keep going. Now, why I say dig there is you can really dig in anywhere to get this one, but this is just how I get it because this is how I have my markers. Because when I'm remembering diamonds, I have markers that I remember. So when you get to this piece of redstone, you just dig diagonally this way. And you have one. And then just keep going in your diagonal pattern. And you have two. So we're at 16 now. Come back to your marker. Go down in the staircase. 17. And if you're looking for like XP or anything, you can always break this redstone up. It gives good XP. Uh, so then you just come behind this gold thing. I just dig next to it. And right here, there's another one. So 18. Dig behind this piece of coal. I find it's easier if you go up one. And you know, it's 19, if you keep going, keep going back there. Give me another one. I didn't get that chest in the middle of the lake, did I, did I? No, I didn't. It's okay, I'll get back and get it in a second. For that, I'll show you guys, in case you guys didn't know that. So you don't really actually need to make an iron pick to begin with. But I'll show you guys where to get that now in a second. Whoops, I'm having lag, that's not good. Better not suffocate. Alright. By the way, I'm using Killer Buys, uh, I think it was Killer Buys, um, texture pack, PvP texture pack. So if you want to come to this lava lake right here, where I got all those right here, there's a chest right in the middle. It's got some iron pickaxe, TNT, etc. Um, Alright, so I think all the ones that I know in this little area is gone. Can you come up here? Remember I had two diamonds there and there? You just dig behind this diamond. You can all do this at once. I just like to get all the visible ones first. Just keep digging right behind that diamond. And you'll get this one. So 21. So then just stop right there and then just dig straight down. 22. Do you see how easy it is to get full diamond in this when you know where they are, right? And then just dig right next to this gold block here. 23. And then just dig out here. Actually, I'll show you guys this other one first, because I'm not going to come back up this way. Right when you're coming down, like, if you're, like, if you're gonna, if you're first coming down and you turn and you see those diamonds there, look at this wall here, just dig right, or I suppose you can dig here, look. And just right here. Diamond. Alright, so let's go back over here. We're at 24 now, so that's a full armor set. Look in this, pretend this is like a square or something here. Just dig right down the middle. Oh, I had a bit of lag there for a second. 
Alright, start at 25, look for this coal block, go to a little bit to the left, go one block to the left, dig in two, and then dig straight up. 26. Okay, so we have a full set now, and I guess I'll just show you guys a couple of other places that I know of. Uh, right here, just kind of look for the staircase, go up one, and then dig in here. Whoop. 27. Cool. Now there's another one here. I'm running out of run. Find this cold block. Take in one. And then just go in a diagonal pattern like this. And there should be one right here. And when you get to that, turn towards the lava lake side of it and just keep going this way. And this will be the last one I'm going to show you guys, I think. Because, sorry, I do know a couple more, but they take a lot of digging to get to, and I don't really feel like it. So, there you go. That's full armor with three to spare. And if you can get that other one, the last house, then you got 30 diamonds. Like, your GG then, right? So, uh, there you go, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed this little diamond finding episode. And uh, don't forget to comment, subscribe, and like for more awesome diamond filled adventures and iron because that's mostly what we have but anyways everybody have a great day